I don't like this matchup going second whatsoever. Oh, sorry, Dead Labs. I did see that, but I got in the middle of this um, in the middle of this uh, turn and all that stuff. Um, do I think Murloc Pally is good? Absolutely. I definitely think that Murloc Paladin is in a very definitely think that it's uh, in a very good place right now. I think that's fair to say. Uh, it's, uh, yeah, and a lot of the meta reports that I've seen, it seems to do very, very well. It has very fast games, a positive win rate. Those are the sorts of things you want for a climbing, for like a serious deck to climb with, I should say. Um, I'm afraid of cat trick, so we're not going to cast the spell. Because I don't want to take all that, I don't want to take all that damage and then risk having Tortola just get taken out and taking more damage. And us not being able to deal with a 4-2. Ugh. And right now we don't want to give our opponent another 4-2. Uh, we'll just go ahead and do this and say go. Dead Labs, you have it, so you're gonna grind for Legend. Um, yeah, that's a that's a really good option. I think I think that's a good option for for grinding the ladder right now. Uh, no doubt about that. Uh, we're in a lot of trouble with this Huffer. There's also no doubt about that. Uh, let's just do this. Um, obviously not ideal, but it at least trades with the board. <laughs> Uh, Smurf, Jedi, the heals should be nerfed. That's what's keeping Q-Block oppressive. Yeah, I think the, the rapid... Oh, wow. Wow, this game went to, uh, turn... Was that coined? Turn 5, coin Rexar. That's kind of strong. Um, I'm gonna put out the strongest death rattle that we can right now. Because our opponent is gonna start throwing out silly, strong minions. And and it's going to be imperative that we have strong death rattles on board. Even though we could have gone Tortola heal. If our opponent had kept their original hero power, we would have done that. But for right now, we need something big that's going to trade in every time. Uh, the hero power of Q-Block is very... Yeah, the, the hero power on Q-Block is super strong. Dealing three and healing three is very, very, is very, very powerful. And that's a deadly shot, so we can live with that. We'll take another Dragoon. Oh! And what a Dragoon it is. Oh, our opponent's doing some of that barn stuff. Let's take a flare. Let's take some flare action if we don't mind. Oh, wow. Smurf Jedi. Um... That's a very personal question. I don't know that we're uh, I don't know that we're equipped to deal with something like that. I don't know that we're equipped to deal with something like that in uh, in this sort of uh, chat sit, uh, settings. I mean, we can deal with this with a dragon fire. The issue is it has four attack. I also love flare right now because it destroys both of these secrets. Hey Tanner, you can't stay. Just wanted to say hi. I th uh, thank you for that. I hope you had a had a good weekend, and uh, I'm hoping to keep streaming later on in the week. So maybe we'll get to chat a little bit more then. Uh, I feel like we should flare no matter what. Let's just get rid of these monster, and and you know what? We were right about one of them. Okay, so let's just do this and then go face. So our opponent can't easily. I mean, obviously this is you know free, you know a free attack here effectively, but. It also sets our opponent into Dragonfire range, and now we have an 8-6 on board, which is kind of cool. Uh, they can do whatever they want, but if they try to nerf Carnivorous Cube, I'm out. It's the coolest not legendary card. Yeah, it, it certainly, certainly is. Uh, Smurf Jedi, she won't let me drive the car I bought her. Oh, well, I think that's, uh, I think that's something you can probably talk about with her, uh, Smurf Jedi. That's a, that's a pretty serious, that's a pretty serious, uh, issue. So I would say, I would say definitely go ahead, sit down, chat with her. That's going to be my advice. Also, this is kind of a topic I don't want to delve too deep into because I feel like I'm going to say the wrong thing. Also, I have, I have no experience in that uh, field. No direct experience, I guess I should say. 
Hey, unleash the hounds. That's a cute card. Hey, kill command. That's not cool at all. Uh, so... Oh, wow, that's a really interesting board clear. Okay, so can we get something that's actually better than this, please? Uh, six and a three. I think we're going to go for that. How about, how about that, everyone? This is just death rattle deal damage, right? Yeah, 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 yeah. I like that a lot. The issue is these are 1-1s, one and our opponent's candle shot is getting a million points of value right now. <laughs> well, Smurf Jedi, I meant I don't have experience in the marriage part, but also the divorce part. <laughs> okay, Remco joke here to break up the uh, to break up the chat here. That's always good. Why does Valera like cooking? Hold on, hold on. Let's think about what Valera says. Um, something about the shadows. Um, what does Valera say? Oh. She says something about the shadows, right? I'm trying to think how shadows can be a play on words for, like, a cooking type of thing. Hold on, hold on. Oh, come on, come on, come on. Oh, that's probably explosive. Yeah, that's a perfect explosive into this board. Oh, watch your back? Oh, that's a good point. Yeah, she says watch your back. Maybe we could say, like, wash your... Um, oh, it's going to be something about washing, right? It's got to be. Uh, let's just hit that explosive trap. Thank you. Let's go ahead and hit that. Oh, wait. Let's see what we get. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think I like that one good. Oh, she is a fan of knives. That's me clapping. I love that joke. <laughs> <laughs> Smurf Jedi, I'll be married till I die, but I'm glad I can make you uncomfortable. <laughs> uh, is this another four attack? Are you kidding? Can we have enough of the four attacks, please? Uh, is this going to be like freezing and then we lose? I shall bring you rest. Okay. That was uh, unexpected to say the least. Cat trick, that's fine. Uh, that goes five. I think we just want a couple more of our friends right now. We're going to go ahead and... Uh, do we care about healing it up? No, we want spells. We want some sweet spells. Do we even have any more spells? Maybe I shouldn't have done that. Uh, four, five, six. Yeah, that's a lot of power. Pain we don't need. We needed another... Oh, we're behind on uh, fatigue, so we can go ahead and do it this way. How much was that thing that we dreamed? Eight. Okay, so that's actually going to be kind of slow. Especially now that we... Oh, yes, that's so good. So now we can dream and Alex, so that's going to be kind of sweet. <laughs> slow clap, well done. <laughs> um, Dango, you're waiting for a meta where Mage is the best deck. You have Golden Mage, but always feel bad using... Always decent, never really great. I kind of like using decks like that, to be honest. Uh, that was a lot of tradage going on, right? Uh, is this going to be explosive now? Explosive. Oh my goodness, value overload. Oh, that is... That is no bueno. Uh, can we just, like, do things here that are awesome, though? Yeah, these are pretty awesome things, I think. Setting our opponent down to 10. They have big minions, but honestly, what is it going to do to them? Oh, and Ysera awakens. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It definitely looks like our opponent can't do much more anymore. But it's just kind of sad. Like, after that good of a game, you really wanted to, uh, you really wanted to finish that one out. So we're going to do this, this... We'll get our the fun lethal. 